With the mechanical energy balance, there's often a unit issue that happens that I'd like to point out. The mechanical energy balance is an energy balance on single input, single output systems where steady flow, constant temperature, no reaction, no heat flow, no phase change, and the fluid is incompressible. The term with the pressure in it and the terms with the velocity in it in particular, we can compare the units of these terms and see a slight problem occurring. The pressure term is delta P over rho. In American engineering units that would be pounds force per square foot divided by pounds mass per feet cubed. The velocity term would be delta V squared over 2 alpha. Alpha is dimensionless. Velocity has units of feet per second. When we square it, we get feet squared per second squared. These don't appear to be the same units, foot pound force per pound mass versus foot squared per second squared. And the reason is this is a force unit divided by a mass unit and we need to resolve these. The resolution of this force unit and this mass unit comes from the definition of the pound force. One pound force is equal to 32.174 foot pound mass per second squared. This definition can be used as a unit conversion to, co to get rid of this pound force. I can say one pound force is equal to 32.174 foot pound mass per second squared. Now I have units of feet squared per second squared and the unit issue is resolved. So again, to resolve this unit problem, we just needed the definition of this force unit in terms of the mass unit. In SI units, the problem also exists. In SI units, delta P over rho is equal to pascals, which is a newton per meter squared, divided by kilograms per meter cubed. And again, we have a force unit and a mass unit. The velocity term, velocity units would be meters per second, and when we square them, we get meters squared per second squared. To resolve this problem in SI units, we need the definition of a newton. One newton is one kilogram meter per second squared. We can use this definition of this force unit to convert the newton in the pressure term. One newton is a kilogram meter per second squared. And now it's in units of meters squared per second squared. So to review, in American engineering units, we need a unit conversion that relates pounds force to foot pound mass per second squared and in SI units we need a conversion of newtons to kilogram meter per second squared and then the terms in the mechanical energy balance are consistent.